Hello, Colorholics! This is day two of my two months vacation uh, in Charlotte, North Carolina, and I'm super excited to be home on the plane. Um, there were a ton of people coughing and sneezing everywhere, and apparently my dad and I caught it. My dad is like super sick, coughing his lungs out. I'm like half and half, teetering between super sick and just a little bit sick. I hope not to get really, really sick, because that would suck. Um, so yeah, I'm drinking a lot of vitamin C. I'm drinking soup. I'm doing all I can not to get sick, or not to get sicker, I should say. So I went to the grocery store today, and it was a good day, because I found these. Cheeseburger Pringles. People, they're amazing. Really, they are. So they had them in Lebanon at this one store near my dad's house. I bought like five of them, and then they stopped ordering them, because they were like, who's gonna buy that? I will. I will buy that. I love these chips. These chips are the best ever. You have no idea, people. You have no idea. So yeah, I got those. I did not, however, find the Cheerios that I've been waiting months to find here because they were also discontinued in Lebanon. Apparently they're discontinued everywhere. They were the best Cheerios ever. Peanut butter Cheerios and banana nut Cheerios. If anyone has ever tried them before, you know that they are amazing. And the best part is that you can put half of your bowl banana nut, half of your bowl peanut butter, and that is the most heavenly combination ever. Comment down below if you've ever tried that combination or if you've tried any other different combinations of Cheerios like fruity Cheerios with peanut butter or I don't know, just comment down below any crazy combinations that you've tried. So stay tuned for so many videos coming up. Um, I'm gonna be doing a house tour, the official house tour. Um, I'm gonna be introducing you to my dog. I'm going to be doing some challenge videos and a whole lot more. So stay tuned for all of that. And if you haven't subscribed, please, please, please subscribe and you'll never miss another video. Seriously, it feels so good to be back home. Like. Not that I don't love Lebanon, I do, but here it's so different. It's like you you come in and you know the language, you were raised the way they were, most people. I mean, it's just kind of like home, but then I'm torn between two homes, Lebanon and the US. It's really confusing <laughs> being from two different places and loving two different places because then you're kind of like confused about where you belong and it's really tough like it's not easy to not know where you belong uh i'm struggling with that and i'm still struggling with that especially now that i'm here and not in lebanon right now so it's like i'm loving it here i'm feeling at home and yeah, all these good feelings, but they're also bringing up like question marks. So, I don't know, I'm rambling, but yeah, the life of an expat. So anyways, look forward to many more videos and I'll see you soon. Bye.